Hey, we're here at Potenko on the old Alameda Naval Base just outside Oakland. We're going to go check out their pull cord power generator, which turns the energy from your muscles into usable electric energy. So this is the pull cord generator being produced by Potenko. It is a device that takes the energy in your muscles and turns it into useful electricity. It's a product that we developed to target the roughly 1.5 billion people around the world who don't have any access to electricity. These are people that have never flipped on a light switch, they've never had sort of like the advantages of electricity, and we're trying to basically give them that gift. We actually looked at a lot of the different possible technologies that could pull energy out of the human body. And some of the things that exist right now are things like hand cranks, where you're doing basically very, very small motions with your body. And the problem with that is that you don't get a lot of energy out of it, and it can fatigue your body very rapidly. So we were trying to come up with something that gives you really, really large motions that allows you to produce a lot of energy, while at the same time having a device that's very, very small and portable. So we're trying to basically target this product to people who've never had access to electricity of any sort whatsoever. So that means Africa, many parts of Southeast Asia, Latin America, I mean, all the parts of the world that you would think of as being in developing countries. So what do you see as the applications in the developing world for the pull cord generator? Well, for developing countries, the main applications that we have identified are lighting, basically producing light for around the home, and charging cell phones. So right now, you're producing actually a large amount of power. Um, with this type of pulling, you're probably producing on the order of about 20 watts or so, 25 mm -hmm. watts of power. At that rate, for one minute of pulling, you get between 30 to 40 minutes of talk time on a cell phone or about an hour of indoor LED light. So how much would like a little kid doing this uh, generate? Well, that's one of the cool things about the device is that it's actually designed to adapt itself for either adults or small children. So even a small child pulling on the device is going to produce a significant amount of power. One of the things that we really wanted to do with this product was give it a lifetime in the field of at least five to ten years. And in order to do that, you really have to make every part of it as robust as possible. One of the things that we ended up innovating on was getting rid of any types of gears from the system. Because in a typical product, if you have gears in it, that's going to severely limit your lifetime. So right now we are doing pilot programs in Africa right now, so we actually have been giving a large number of devices to people in these countries, getting their feedback over long periods of time, and the response has been incredibly favorable. I mean, people are just overwhelmed by how much this device can change their lives. So there's just a huge level of excitement, both in Africa, and then we're also starting a similar program in Southeast Asia, really just understanding the full breadth of the market. We just wrapped up here at Potenko taking a look at their pull cord power generator, which they say could provide energy to billions of people in the developing world who don't have wall outlets that we all take for granted. That's obviously a cool idea with a lot of smart engineering built in, but the real question is how and when these devices are going to actually get into the field. They need to be cheap enough that people in the developing world making a dollar or two a day can actually afford them.